Hold on tight, because today we're diving into a fighter jet that's redefining India's air power. A jet packed with cutting-edge technology, raw power, and futuristic capabilities. Yes, we're talking about the HAL Tejas MK2, India's next-generation multirole beast. But hey, before we take off, if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any future updates. Welcome to Car Updaters. The HAL Tejas MK2 isn't just an upgrade, it's a complete transformation. Developed by Hindustan Aeronautics Limited, this new jet is designed to fill the shoes of aging fighters like the Mirage 2000, Jaguar, and MIG-29. And it's doing it in style, with a stealthy design, next-gen avionics, and a deadly arsenal. So what makes the MK2 so special? Let's start with the design. Compared to the original Tejas, the MK2 is bigger, meaner, and sleeker. It has a longer fuselage and can carry over 6.5 tons of weapons, nearly twice that of the previous version. Its canards, those small wings near the cockpit, improve maneuverability and stability, giving it that modern 4.5 generation fighter jet look. Under the hood, the Tejas MK2 is powered by the General Electric F414 engine, capable of producing over 98 kilonewtons of thrust. That gives it a top speed of Mach 1.8, and allows it to outpace and outmaneuver many of its regional rivals. But speed alone doesn't win air battles, situational awareness does. That's where the jet's glass cockpit and advanced active electronically scanned array AESA radar come in. These give the pilot a full digital interface with radar coverage reaching up to 300 kilometers, allowing them to track multiple targets in real time. It's also integrated with infrared search and track IRST and electronic warfare systems, making it a powerful tool for both offense and defense. And yes, this jet is truly multirole. Whether it's conducting deep strike missions, air-to-air -air combat, ground attack, or even precision bombing, the Tejas MK2 can handle it all. It can be armed with Astra air-to-air -air missiles, Brahmos Ing supersonic cruise missiles, smart bombs, and a whole range of guided weapons. It's a full package, all-in-one agile, homegrown fighter. On the tech side, the MK2 also supports network-centric warfare, which means it can operate as part of a larger battle group, sharing live data with other aircraft, drones, and ground systems. This is a huge leap toward making India's Air Force future ready. And guess what? It's not just about firepower. The Tejas MK2 also boasts low radar cross-section for better stealth and survivability. It's built with composite materials that reduce weight while enhancing strength. Plus, it's designed with modular architecture, making it easier to upgrade, maintain, and evolve with time. The first flight of the Tejas MK2 is expected soon, and by 2028, it could enter full-scale production. Once inducted, it will play a central role in India's air defense strategy, potentially replacing dozens of older jets. This isn't just a fighter jet, it's a symbol, of technological progress, military independence, and strategic confidence. The HAL Tejas MK2 is India's leap into the future of aerial warfare, powerful, precise, and proudly indigenous. What are your thoughts on this next-gen fighter? Let us know in the comments. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Car Updaters for more epic military tech breakdowns. Until next time, fly high and stay sharp. Thank you.